welcome back. We've got horticulture expert Kelly McGowan with us on Skype this morning. Good morning, Kelly. Good morning, Elisa, and happy birthday. Oh, thank you, thank you. We're talking about my favorite subject today. <laughs> But, but as we should, because if you guys were not living under a rock within the last week, I'm sure you've seen some reports about this, like, murdering hornet that seems like it's taking over the U.S., and Kelly is here to set us straight with some facts on what it actually is, right? Yeah, yeah. Well, there's been a lot of stories going around about this murderous hornet, and I just want to maybe clear up some myths about it today. And um, for one, there has only been one single hornet found in the United States, and that was in Washington State. There was a nest of these found in Vancouver, Canada in 2019, and that has since been eradicated, and then this single hornet was found in Washington State last year as well. And of course, they're actively monitoring for uh, more of these hornets, but the good news is, is that single incident was all that we have found, and there are no other um, instances of this hornet here or anywhere else in the United States. Okay, so they're not everywhere coming in and like mass invasion. <laughs> um, now, where, where is it from and why is it a big deal if we start to see more of these? Yeah, well, they are from Asia. They're called the Asian giant hornet, and they are large. They are, they can be up to two inches in length, so they are far larger than anything we have here in the United States. And in their native Asia, they can kill honeybees. They actively kill their native honeybees. So it's something that we're certainly going to be on the lookout for here in the United States, but there are you know, a lot of people think that we're just going to um, have swarms of these, you know, this summer, and that's certainly not the case. Okay, that would be crucial because we need those honeybees to pollinate. So if, if someone finds something that they're not sure what it is, can they give you guys a call? Yeah, certainly call the Extension Office. We are available to help identify any kind of insects, but I just want to let people know, please, please, please do not go out and start spraying any flying insect because you think it may be one of these murderous hornets. <laughs> That's not the case. They're here and uh, we need to protect our native pollinators. Thank you so much for those tips, Kelly. We appreciate it. We'll be right back.